James Russell, and I'm in 12th grade, and I'm a poet from Bellevue West. And this is my poem, Intelligence. Growing up, my parents told me not to curse, saying that it was unintelligent and was for stupid, I mean, not smart people. That I should show my frustrations in larger words and complex phrases, but then I became obnoxious with my superfluous explanations of emotions I did not understand, and again was told not to exponentiate, to make a mountain out of a molehill, so it's easier just to keep it inside. But when my parents questioned why I wasn't talking as much, I couldn't explain to them this frustration I felt for fear of this unlike you and being normal language. I was standing in compliance in this holy house with simple thoughts and feelings, and I was at the breaking point for both, torn between the rights of myself and the rules of my house. My mountain out of a molehill has turned into a volcano ready to erupt. Well, aren't I screwed? Because I don't need to say beep, because that is the measure of my intelligence with my 3.79 GPA and the honors cords on my cap. I don't need to say beep because that is the measure of my intelligence. I understand that I am my parents' product and that they hoped that two negatives would end up in a positive and a perfectly positive person who has no problems, particularly one who is punctual and professional, one who will become a postgraduate, a prosperous postgraduate. I never knew that PG stood for postgraduate, though. That even after the age of 13, PG was all I could see. PG was all I could know. Yet with that limitation placed upon me, I can still prove that I am more than the parental limits. Those, look at the ex accomplishments and see through the praising haze. My intelligence did not flourish because of that persistent PG rating. My intelligence is known despite the silent yell to say, I am tired of the beeps, and f with my cap in my hand, I am free to stand and to scream, finally free, <laughs> with proof of my intelligence. <laughs>